Azriel, the Emerald Sorceress here. Let's play cards. All right, Libra, let's see what signs might be relevant. Taurus. Gemini. Any other signs here? Libra. Leo. Capricorn, Pisces, Aquarius, Aries, and Sag. Jeez, Libra. What else is new? All right. Let's see. What's going on for Libra spirit? What's going on for Libra? What is it today that we have to look forward to? Or tomorrow, or the next day, whenever it resonates. If y'all could hit the thumbs up button, I would be really grateful if we could all work together to try to help move the channel up and along here. Could get the messages out. Please and thank you, please and thank you. All right, Libra, let's see what's going on here. A healer. The healer of ages. Oh, it's two. Thinking man and time for a rest. So some male air sign. Or you, Libra. Flexibility. Uh, teachability. Be Remain open-minded uh, while things are changing here. Uncertain about the future, walking away, uh, choices, choices, choices about a home or being paralyzed in a home, stuck in confusion, like what do you do, what do you do, what do you do? It's time for a change here, it's time to be happy, 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 and it's time to be protected or protect yourself, something like that. What else do you got for Libra? Oh no, two again. Round in, round in, round. So that's like spiraling out of control. It's also like going backwards in order to go forwards. It's like somebody's not learning their lesson, so they, they've got to repeat it here. And it fucking hurts. Grief, grief, loss, disbelief, and dark energies which I keep talking about. I'm only doing three today because then I'll be here for an hour and I don't wanna. I don't wanna. I just wanna get the message, that's it. Um. All right. Shit. The nine of wands, I don't wanna. All right, what do we got here with this flexibility? Uh, round and round and round and round we go. Oh, it's painful. Round and round and round. I don't know. That's what the Wheel of Fortune does, right? Here it goes. Eight cups out the door. Ready to go? See you later. Gator, there's no looking back once the door is closed here. Nothing left to see here. Teachability, learning a lesson. Karma is the wheel of fortune as well. It's out of your hands here. Uh, it's a tower moment. It's time to uh, do the journey on your own here. Or, what is this? Ten of Swords. Something's over for sure. It's painful. So, uh, the Ten of Cups is out about happiness, caring, uh, and family, joy, celebrating. I feel like somebody's got to, like, move on and find happiness or something like that. Or, oh, King and Queen of Swords and the Ace of Cups, Hangman. Uh, Knight of Swords, a quick, swift close of a cycle here. Like, the door slammed shut, Five of Pentacles. 
door slam shut, five of pentacles, there's the full four. It won't open. It's fucking locked. What's behind that? Death. Somebody is tired of juggling here. They're tired of being uh, fearful. They are tired of... They're just tired. I just feel tired. What is this? Round and round and round and round. And round we go. The high priestess. Three of swords. The hangman. I feel like intuitively six of cups. What's behind that? Ace of Cups, the Lovers, and the King and Queen of Swords again. Uh, there might have been some, like... All right, first of all, why don't you just do this? So the High Priestess could be the other woman. She's also the Secret Keeper. She also knows things. Without knowing them, Hangman... Without actually, like, having to um, participate. They're very perceptive here. Three of Swords. So, this High Priestess saw, knew intuitively that, they, that, that something was going backwards here. Hangman, and put that to a stop, which causes the Three of Swords here. Another one. Oh, shit. Yeah, nine of pentacles. People are single and ready to mingle. All right. Six of swords flew on the floor. It's on the three of swords. That's the nine of swords. It's a nightmare. It's so stressful. It's painful. It literally brings pain to the heart and the brain. It makes your eyes tired. It is fucking draining. It's uh, it's too much to take here. Five of cups. It's draining. It's draining of your energy here. So it's time to leave that behind. Uh, four of wands, ten of wands, because you know it's too much. It's too heavy. It's a burden you've been carrying alone here. Uh, trying to keep a home together. Trying just to keep the people together. Trying to keep peace here. Ten, ten. It's a decision that you had to make, I think, like, for yourself, for your own, uh... Not peace of mind, but for your own um, heart. Like, literally for your heart. I feel like your heart just can't take much more uh, insanity or pain or grief or whatever. Magician in the sun. Three of cups, six of pentacles, strength, judgment... All right, a magician can be so many things. Can I have another one, please? Queen of Pentacles, who is sideways, and the Empress. Uh, so we have set, set, blah, 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 blah. here we go. I was talking over myself again. Um, temperance. So that's like an equal give and take, a, a, a sharing. It is a blending. It is also medication or alchemy, if you will, which is medication. I feel like somebody's manipulation or dark energies is right behind the magician here. Somebody is carrying around some darkness here and it was depleting you uh, of your... Uh, groundedness of your balance of your stability quite honestly here empress this two of cups situation the truth about it it's the fucking seven of swords nine of swords so whatever i was just saying right uh draining you empress and i feel like you know that you 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 know better two of cups a partnership a soulmate here is the Seven of Swords, Nine of Swords. And I just added that up right there. So of course it came out. And then the Six 
whatever. I'm stop adding, please. It's not a math problem. So the seven of swords is somebody that is trying to get away with something. They're trying to do the least amount possible here. And it's really just causing like, I don't know, you can't, there's not, not, not good sleep here. Somebody's being tormented at night, I feel like. Uh, the Ace of Swords about uh, clarity, about truth, about, I don't know, I just feel like saying off with their heads. Somebody needs healing. I also feel like somebody maybe like didn't want to see that it wasn't working out. I also feel like somebody's mother might not like you, Libra. What else is new? That's the same old shit. Well, the other day I was watching back a video and I definitely added something wrong. So that's not cool. Uh, nine and seven is 16, which is the seven. So it just is the seven of swords no matter what. Somebody could have been arrested in the past for something. Something about purgatory. Self-imprisoned here. Like all you have to do is cut its head off. And you'll be good to go. Alright. <clears throat> what else you got for Libra here? Hierophant teachable. The Hierophant teaches lessons here. Uh, frozen. Now is not the time. Tower. So I also feel like somebody is so intuitive or they their powers are so great that they when they're told to fucking jump, they fucking jump. Okay. So no longer let it be family home, blah, 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 tower, tower, tower. So something is no longer serving your highest good and the universe and God are trying to send you a message here. Um, a high priestess. That something is working against you. Uh, some, tower to some experience. Tower to the longevity. Uh, somebody's not mature here. As I pull out the child, break free a catalyst in the sky. So letting something go, releasing it. It does require some efforts, but something uh, ignited this here. Um, a strong desire to for freedom. Uh, balancing masculine and feminine energies. Just like I said, I feel like somebody had you off fucking balance here. What's this with the round in, round in, round here? A woman. What else? Another fucking woman? No, this is Mother Earth. So that's talking about centering. The center of everything and balance. Access. Uh, experiencing duality. I also feel like somebody is a bit of a, a, a they, pro they like to project. Um, they're not quite sure who they are, where they belong here. Death. So in order for balance, as I'm saying that, it's at the bottom. In order to balance out something out, this woman here, high priestess, has to make a decision here uh, and they have been guided to make a decision and they also might have been warned about going backwards here guided to separate from something doesn't matter if you love it like it's toxic with the fucking ball and chain here somebody's reputation some things never change here even though like your heart might desire something it's uh, it's third person. It's other people involved, strangers, and that something else's influence, like that dark entity I was talking about. So, and then we have swans here. Something about a pair of things, quite possibly, as well. <sighs> Breathe. The star. 
Wishes, peace, bless, falling in love, hopes and dreams here. Page of Swords, lovers. Uh, an illumination and inspired action. I feel like all of this goes over there. And here's the magician again. And a child and another child. Uh, Short-lived, blocked. Somebody just is deceptive. Is a chameleon. There's a, a lot of blockages. Somebody is stubborn here. People are watching and spying. There's something about a Gemini. Uh, very exceptional here. And then grounded. So it's your time to get grounded here. Uh, to have peace of mind, I feel like. What? I don't know what this little girl is doing today. Let's find out. What's with the kids out here? Lightness of being here. Uh, someone's trying to tell you something about an Aquarius here. There's a tower. Move on. Uh, duality. Divinely, divine intervention. Move, move, move. Move, move, move. A new beginning here. Something about mama. So, I don't know. I have a little girl that flies around. She don't really... She never puts her feet on the ground, ever. But she's always out and about. Baby, yeah. Baby steps. Trust your gut, the head of the pack. But she'll come tell me stuff, is what I'm saying. Um, her and her little buddy Silas. They're ghosts, just saying. So, you're getting warnings here from your spirit guides. Two of mine just happen to be fucking children. And then we got a few adults, too. I have um, a dog as well. His name is Fitzy. And I got Grandma Roberta and Grandma Claire and... Grandpa Al. But Grandpa Al doesn't really say anything ever, never. And then, um, growing up, I watched my best friend die for, I don't know, most of my life, I guess. She died when I was 21. She was three years older than me. Uh, her birthday's 9-22. Mine's 9-25. So we're very much alike. That's Virgo Libra Cuss, but she was very... I have to have Fargo in me anyway, so it doesn't matter. Um, <clears throat> so she's with me, and I have some illnesses that uh, I swear I absorbed from her. So as healers, when you're around people, you absorb their shit, that stuff leaves scars. So knowing when to leave and to get out is a big deal. Um, I even heard somebody say it not that long ago, psychic mediums usually die young. Because they fucking pick up other people's illnesses and they can they allow energy to come and talk to them they invite it blah 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 so it could be it's not proven but obviously because not everyone believes in psychics or the supernatural but that's my story and I'm sticking to it connected oh my god what are you doing I'm cleaning him up a snake what was I just saying? Cut his head off. Cut the snake's head off. Somebody also like silent treatment. Or like connecting and collaborating here was counterproductive. Or somebody just can't stop thinking about you sexually. This masculine uh, energy, alpha male. They want to dominate you. They want to protect you. They want to, and I don't think dominate, like, in a mean way. I This is something different. I feel like seduction, sexuality. Uh, somebody wants to, I don't know, uh, help you. Finances, they want to be beneficial. Or maybe that's just what you need. I hate when you guys do this to me. Uh... Duty bound. Yeah, somebody wants to 
take care of you, I feel like. What is this now? Somebody in the community, uh, they want to take you on a date here. Somebody with a fixed sign. I don't know what the fixed signs are. I can look it up real quick, though. Because I have nothing better to do. And I went through all those cards fast. 20 minutes, Libra. 20 minutes. How do you like that? Fixed signs. What are they? Taurus, Leo, Scorpio, and Aquarius. A soulmate. Blooming love. Somebody wants you to have faith in them. Judgment. Home. That you, like, belong with them. Tower, magnet, and the shit. Move. Something is, like, there's this heavy magnetic pull, Libra. And it's causing tower after tower after tower after tower until this magnet is able to get what it wants here. Uh, something about communicating, texting. Somebody might be nervous to talk to you, Empress, here. This emperor. A man, obviously, right? Uh, fear with the moon. Maybe you haven't talked to this person in a while. It could literally be an Aries. It could be any sign. You haven't talked to them in a while. An island. You've been estranged here. Uh, somebody's been in isolation. Did that flip? No. That one did, though. But now, like, uh, seeking truth, discovery, making a plan. We just kind of saw that, though, too. Independent, right? Some people have been... Uh, somebody wants to, wants a partnership here. Challenge the status quo, uh, evolution. I feel like somebody wants you to give them a chance here. Out of nowhere. And then there's a the little girl again. She's like, you're going to like it. Why are we going to like it? Oh, that's why. See, she does tell me things all the time. She's like, but you have free will, you know. You can do whatever you want. And also, she's out listening to people. Here. So there's a lot of lusting. Allow trust, divine timing, spirit, ghost, the Akashic Records, my dead little baby that runs around and does shit and brings it back to tell her mother. She's like, hey, do you know what I saw today? Did you know what I heard today here? Insight. Important. Pay attention here. She's she's very excited about this. So the person could be a magician as well. They want to talk. Maybe you haven't talked to them since the summer. I also feel like uh, the process of arrival. Oh, God. One more. Green light. Peace, effective communication and collaboration with somebody that's just like you here. Oh, why are those two out there together, though? As I say that, I feel like you feel like you're not like this person here. But you are. Like, because I usually talk about the crow and the owl. Birds of prey don't get along. Period. They just don't. Owls like to eat crows' eggs and da, da da da. And then crows like to pick on owls, but it's not just one crow, it's a murder of crows here. So I think this is like peace between people that they're not sworn enemies, but they have been on the outs. They might have had an argument. 743 might be relevant. The time, or you can just look that up here. Ace of Wands. Somebody wants to bring you something. Or make you an offer. Or, I don't know, that's the cock, isn't it? Maybe somebody just wants to put on a condom. I have no idea. I don't usually talk like that. Ah! Six of Cups. Somebody you know from the past. A uh, masculine with the sun. It could be a Leo. But I just feel like this person is, like, they have a lot of power. And they're really energized. 
high priestess. And they're also a high priestess, high priest here, uh, with gifts from higher up here. Uh, I feel like telepathically, right? Because uh, this is intuition. This is kind of psychic. Telepathically, I feel like somebody, th there's a conversation going on here between these two people, and that's Gemini. Somebody that like, can't let go, Seven of Pentacles, they want to, they're like stuck on you here. Ace of Cups, they want to offer you the Ace of Cups, they want to offer you a contract here, stuck on you like the devil. Uh, Two of Cups. Somebody wants you to be their partner. And not just like magician and temperance. These are two very high vibing people here. Very high vibing. They're very powerful uh, when together here. Again with the like, this is like scrying, but I'm... Um, there's a conversation that has been going on here that has been unspoken. Like, we got the Two of Cups. We got the Lovers here. We have the fucking penis. We have uh, the Devil can just be sex, too, here. The Devil also has power, just like the High Priestess and the Magician here. These people are, like, past life soulmates connected to, like, meet up here on earth to do magic together uh yeah queen of wands seven of wands i feel like somebody feels like you're beautiful and they're so sad that you walked away from them they're sad that there was a fight with justice here uh they don't want conflict they haven't stopped thinking about you four cups fucking where's that other one i don't even know I haven't stopped thinking about you. It was the Seven of Pentacles. It just kind of just disappeared here. Somebody sees security and, like, longevity with you. Somebody didn't know where you went. Eight of Swords at the moon. It's like you disappeared here. Nine of Wands. You blocked people. You left them out in the cold here. More. Shit. Yeah, and somebody's like, fuck, no, ten of wands, what do you mean? No, 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 hangman, six of swords, they have been like, had their vehicle idling, just ready and waiting for you to be like, all right, here I am, six of wands, after this hangman. I feel like telepathically somebody's trying to get you to see something from a different view. <sighs> All right, Libra. Frenemies, judgment, reconciliation with of a contract where there's like a lot of abundance. I, f I feel like, but what do I know? I'm just playing cards. And they're just feelings. All right. I'm usually pretty right, actually. Um. Oh, I didn't have the other cards in there, so I don't have to do that. See, that's my favorite. The elephant. Partners in crime. Maybe not crime, really. But somebody feels like you're very unique here, Libra, here. Look at Very unique, Libra. Somebody is, like, pining after you. They know that Libra is the one here, somebody very exceptional. The lights are, they're like meeting up to like light up together. 11, 7 11. I don't know what it is with the set. I'm not usually like that. Steady movement forward. Somebody might want you to come see them. Something about trains. I know the trains go by here at night. Not usually at 7, though. It's usually like midnight. Uh, somebody could have to cross some train tracks, like, on the adventure. Something about third person. People. La, 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 la. Uh, trust your and knowing, Libra. Believe your instincts. This is, like, an instinctual thing here. Empress. I feel like maybe you're, like 
fighting this communication with this person because you feel like it's like this. Which are both very powerful birds, too, in their own rights here. Are these birds were both used back in the day for the post office, whatever? So they're both very, can be trained to do things. Maybe somebody's starting a new job. I did say work together, like training. An odd couple. Odd. What is that? What does the loon say? Uncommon bonds or something like that. Here, Jupiter is bringing these people together, bringing you together. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, and there's the boy. I knew I would see him in the cross. <clears throat> what does he want? He's saying something is long lasting here. Oh, fuck off. With some alpha male that is. Or like a man boss here. Maybe you're gonna get a job unexpectedly. Uh, where there has been baggage and burden, there will be less baggage and burden. Unexpectedly. Happy coincidences. Uh, I feel like somebody thought they were never gonna see you again too. Unexpected rendezvous here because you blocked them. Here, and they were left in the dark with the moon, and now the light's on. I say that, it could be a Pisces, but left in the dark with the moon here, but, like, the storm's over, problem's over, breaking free, there's more sexual energy, something about third eye, there's another fucking bird here. Uh, oh, and that's what I was looking for, the loons, uncommon bonds. Somebody's really nervous about this. And somebody has been working really, really hard to manifest you telepathically here. They lost desire. They just can't take it here. All right, Libra, I'm putting this deck away and I'm going to grab the other deck and then that is going to be it here. Spare guys, please. Please. That's enough for today. I don't read after it gets dark anyways because the energy around here gets weird. Like, really weird. Try not to read before dark or after dark. Uh, there's a graveyard not too far from here. And where I live is the home of the KKK. It's where it started. So you can imagine the energies that are in the town that I live in. It's bad. Like, really bad. I didn't know that until after I moved here because I took it off the website because of BLM. Don't give five minutes if you're not going to give it five years. Aquarius, just call it that. Spiritual matters. You have been guided spiritually by your spirit guides here in separation. Listen, listen, listen. So, right around the corner, I'm telling you. I don't know, like, somebody wants you to... Go see them. Somebody's coming to see you. Somebody wants to work with you, Libra. And I feel like it's more than one somebody's. It's better to seek forgiveness than ask permission. So whatever, like, falling out, that's over there. This is here. Uh, somebody's apologetic. Ooh. That's not cool, though. Don't accept an apology from someone that just sucker punched you. You say one thing. I thought it was different, but it's not. You say one thing to my face, and meanwhile, liar, liar, liar. Somebody's full of shit. And I feel like this, like, don't accept an apology from someone that just sucker punched you. Like, when someone tries to kill you, just leave it at that if you live. Don't let them back in your life. All right, you thought the grass was greener. Like, like that's what I'm saying. Like, ugh. You're your own worst enemy. Take a step back. A clever person solves a problem. A wise one avoids it. Something should be avoided here. Someone's, when the job is done, walk away. That's what I said. If someone tries to kill you, you don't go back for more. When your husband beats the fuck out of you, you don't go back for more. All right? 
I don't care if it's the first time. I just did it. It still didn't work out quite right because there's a lot of other problems too. That wasn't the only problem. Granted, he never touched me again, but it, he never drank again either. All right, I think that's all we got for today, Libra. I would like to never take anything for granted. It's all kind of the same shit. Do you have something good to say, guys? Because otherwise, I like kindness counts. Uh, know your truth. Virtue, patience is a virtue, and ask for guidance. So you got the guidance here. I also feel like you're a very patient and kind person, and you know your truth. Like, it's not your fault. I mean, it takes two to tango, but live your bliss. Stay open-minded. See, and this is someone else that wants you to stay open-minded. Give without expectation. Somebody wants to give to you this time. Now. All right, quickly, tell me something good. What's good? The devil. Tell me something good, and I get the devil and the four swords. So, I don't know, maybe you defeated the devil? <sighs> What's good? What's good? What's good? Eight of Wands, Hangman. Quietly took out the devil, because you're strong here. Or somebody that's obsessed with you, like, message, 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 travel, 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 fast, 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 after hangman, or maybe you want to think about it, but strength, somebody, uh, star, strength, give it the expectations, somebody who wants to, like, build you up, I feel like, six of cups, and a star, Somebody feels like you are a star, the chariot, see? Somebody in the world traveling. And I was like talking about time traveling, like back to the future, six of cups, the chariot, and the world. Like, I'll meet you in such and such a date and such and such a time. Like, something has been divinely planned by the fucking universe. And we're just their little game pieces here. Eight of Swords. The wheel. Uh, you're about to be lifted out of the Eight of Swords, Nine of Swords here into the Four of Wands. But I feel like uh, Seven of Wands. It's been a lot of work here. Offense, defense, please don't fight me, Ace of Swords. Somebody, uh, I feel like they can feel your pain. An Emperor. I can't even make it up. They can feel it, tender, the princess of cups. That's also the intuition here from some third party here, angelic forces, or they've just been fed messages by your spirit guides, their spirit guides, they're in cahoots, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Ten of cups, two of cups. They're like working real hard to make something happen, five of swords. They're uh, like... Pulling out all the stops, tower here. They want this two of cups here to like be a contract, be a thing here, to work together, eight of pentacles, to focus on one, to have a relationship with one another. Uh, what's that? Justice. Justice in the Hierophant is a Taurus. <sighs> Emperor, Aries, Taurus, Scorpio, Decisions, and the Emperor, Empress, I mean, a reunion, both High Priestesses here, uh, talking without talking, and I feel like High Priestess, this was a missed opportunity, but here it is. The universe is like, come on, it's the Ten of Pentacles, it's the Sun, it's the Ace of Pentacles, Two of Swords, stop blocking the Lovers card. 
Ugh, Gemini. All right, so for real, for real, that's all I have for today, Libra. Until next time, may the force be with you.